In this short tutorial, you will learn how to use Canvas assignments as exit tickets. Let's begin by looking at an exit ticket from the student's perspective. So we'll go to modules and the student has uh, an assignment here where we are expecting some text entry. And so the exit ticket is asking the students to use the following stem sentences to complete the exit ticket. Today I learned, one thing I found interesting was, and a question I still have. So uh, I am the student and I will click on submit assignment in order to get the rich content editor where I can type my response. And so I can also copy the stem sentences and place them right in here to help me. And so today I learned. Okay, so the student would think about what they did in class and uh, the teacher went over uh, Punnett squares possibly. And so the student may say, today I learned about genetics. One thing I found interesting was there are dominant and recessive traits. And a question I still have is how to fill out a Punnett square. And so the student would submit the assignment and confetti because it was submitted successfully. So going back to the teacher's course, the teacher would go um, to the module and check for assignments that have been turned in by going to the speed grader. And I can see right here a list of all my students and you notice there is a dot by EdTech and Design that is the student that turned in the assignment. So I can click on that and here you see all of the responses. And so as the teacher, I could review the responses and see if uh, the student needs any feedback. So the student is saying today I learned about genetics. Well, that might not tell me enough. So I could here under assignment comments, mm -hmm. ask the student to elaborate. So could you tell me a little more about what you learned on genetics? Specifically, maybe, what did you learn about Punnett squares? And so I could submit that and the student would get that comment. And possibly uh, for right now, I would not grade it until I get a response, okay? So going back to the student, the student would then see a response from the teacher and notice it pops up right here on the uh, home screen. You see the assignment with the check mark and a response. The student could click into it, read the response from the teacher, comment back to the teacher as well, and then resubmit the assignment with new information. Okay. And so that is how a teacher could assess uh, students using assignments and using an exit ticket as an example. I'm going to go ahead and go back to the teacher's course so that I can show you how to create the assignment. So this was the assignment we were looking at and I will click edit so that you can see how it was built. And so uh, basically put the name of the assignment at the top and in the rich content editor, place um, the name of your exit ticket or formative assessment, whatever it is you're wanting to do with them in this assignment. Uh, in this case, it was an exit ticket. So I placed the title a little large so they could um, definitely see what that is. And then the instructions for the exit ticket. And so in this case, the STEM sentences. As you scroll down, 
You can decide how many points to give for this assignment. Um, you could even decide to do complete or incomplete if you don't wanna actually give it uh, points or a grade, but just um, completion. And then make sure to click submission type and choose online. And then text entry to get that rich content editor. You can allow several attempts or limit the number of attempts and choose how many, okay? And then make sure to give it a due date. All right, that is how to create the assignment uh, and using it as a formative assessment inside Canvas. If you have any questions, please uh, reach out to us at uh, edtech, saisd.net slash edtech. And uh, thank you for watching.